fine today. Okay, now meet me again, Miss Linda, here, and we are going to start our lesson video today. What will we learn today? Hmm, are you curious of it? So, now let's check this out. Now, we will learn how to describe sea animals. First, oyster. What is oyster like? It has oval shell. It produces pearl. Pearl adalah mutiara. Shell cangkang. And it has soft body. Memiliki tubuh yang lunak. Jellyfish. It shakes to move. Dia bergerak dengan bergoyang-goyang. It has tentacles. Kaki-kakinya yang banyak itu disebut tentacles. And it stings. Menyengat. Seperti ada setrumnya ya. Crab. It covers with shell. Nah, masih ingat shell? Cangkang. It lives in ocean and fresh water. Dia bisa hidup di laut ataupun air tawar. It has claws. Memiliki capit. What is shrimp like? It has antenna. Punya antena ya. It has lots of legs. Memiliki kaki yang jumlahnya banyak. It has no backbone. Tidak memiliki tulang belakang. What is starfish like? It has no backbone like a shrimp. The shape is like star and it can crawl but not swim. Jadi starfish itu tidak berenang tetapi berguling-guling. What is octopus like? Like a jellyfish, it has tentacles. But it has only eight tentacles. It has globe-shaped head. Kepalanya berbentuk seperti globe atau bola dunia. It has beak. Memiliki paruh wah like a duck what is dolphin like it is smart like you and it has blowhole to breath because dolphin is a mammal dolphin cannot breath underwater karena dolphin itu adalah mamalia dia tidak bisa bernafas di bawah permukaan air sehingga dia perlu keluar dari air untuk bernafas dan memiliki lubang yang dinamakan blow hole di atas kepalanya untuk bernafas it has echo location dia mengeluarkan suara untuk mengetahui benda di sekitarnya and the last one is shark it's not a baby shark but it's a shark it has 3,000 teeth giginya berjumlah 3,000 and it has fins memiliki sirip it has tiny scales memiliki sisik yang kecil atau lembut karena shark adalah jenis ikan not like a dolphin yang adalah mammals Shark memiliki sisik. Now, can you mention again one of those animals' characteristics? Okay, now let's mention it to group with voice notes. So, thank you everyone. Sudah bosan di rumah aja? Jangan dulu dong. Yuk, belajar bahasa Inggris bareng English House for Children and Adults. Ikutin terus ya videonya sambil kita seru-seruan bareng. 
So, stay safe at home. See you again and bye.